Hello friends, welcome back or welcome to the channel. So in the past, I have made some videos where we've read my Instagram comments. They can get pretty wild, but I thought let's take it one step further and let's just read my DMs. I'm actually nervous, not gonna lie. I have been going through my DMs for the last few weeks, trying to find the funniest ones and sifting through all the inappropriate comments, all of the highs. There's literally people who just say hi, hi. Like I'm all for shooting your shot, but it's getting a little bit repetitive, okay? And I picked some of the best I could find. Somebody literally just sent me a Shrek uh, movie poster and says, you and me, Friday night, I'll supply the mozzarella sticks and Shrek, you supply the pizza. I'm not gonna on somebody for shooting their shot, you know? Listen, this is better than most of them. I'm not gonna lie. A lot of them are just like, send me. Okay, this one I can't even show you because I would like to make money on this video. It's literally just a thick old anime booty. It's just a cartoon booty. Like, why am I getting photos of f***ing anime booties? I don't understand. It's like, what do you think about it? I don't know. This one cuts deep. Phagomania is a psychological condition that causes a person to be obsessed with food or the excessive desire to eat. Somebody sends me that and goes, you have phagomania. The f*** are you trying to say? What, because I like eating? Because I like food? That's the only message they've ever sent me. They send me a psych psychological condition and they're like, this you? It's like, yeah, it is me. I like eating. I, I, I've admitted that, all right? Food turns me on. We get it. I'm not offended at all. I'm fine. I'm totally fine. The first one's kind of wholesome. They respond to a story. They say, you are just absolutely stunning. Then I post another one. They just say, Thanks, Andrew. Appreciate it. I thought you were going strong there. You were just complimenting, you know, my beauty and and and, and grace. And then you just you just had to ruin it with tits, bro. Like, what do you? We had something good going, man. What do you like? What are you doing? A photo of me completely clothed. Like, don't get me wrong. It's weird when people say the things that they do, but I kind of expect it, and I'm just like, eh. Like, I just brush it off. I don't really worry about it. But you usually get it more on like the bikini pictures, and when I clearly like have a low cut top on, I'm fully clothed in this, in jeans and a cover up, and. This this man just says flash it. These, okay? He's straight to the point. He going for it, dude. I also stream on Twitch. If you're not following me there, twitch.tv slash Tanner. I don't think you guys understand how many people get banned every day in the chat room whenever I stream because they're just like, show us your shit, flash your shit. And my mods are like, no, we do not objectify the streamer, okay? Let her enjoy her Fortnite gameplay, okay? Ah, the old classic. Send me when people say this to me, is there, is there like a little thought in their mind where they think that, I just went a little bit British then, is there a little thought in their mind? <laughs> is there a thought in their mind for one second that I might actually send back? Is that something that they're like, maybe, maybe if I just ask nicely, she'll send me some pics. Is that where we're at? Ah, yes. The peaches. Wait, is it a peach? That is, that's the peach emoji, right? The butt emoji. <gasps> Are they saying that I got a nice butt? Because I'll take it. Okay, they're saying I got a fat donk. Sorry. <laughs> I mean, I'll take it. They literally said nothing else. This is literally all they said. I'll take it as a compliment, okay? Uh, they might not mean it like a compliment, but I'm gonna take it like one. Send this to 10 prettiest girls you know. If you ignore it, then you will turn ugly in one year. None of that made sense. Do people don't understand grammar? And then, because I didn't respond, they say your forehead is fatter than your ass. Enough with the forehead jokes. All you guys have is forehead jokes and rent jokes. That's all you got. And living in my brother's shadow jokes. Get creative, okay? My forehead is fatter than my Probably true. Can me suck you my teeth itch. Somebody is in my DMs telling me that their teeth itch. How do teeth itch? Do teeth eat? Eat? Why can't I speak? First up, on the 24th of December, 2019, so literally the day before Christmas, meant to be one of the most jolly times of the year. They go, you don't deserve to live. And then they responded almost a year and a half later and says, why was I so mean? <laughs> yeah, why were you mean? Hey, listen, maybe they're a kid. They've grown up a little bit. I get it. I get it. So yeah, don't be mean. Don't tell people they don't deserve to live. Grow up, all right? You're ugly. Me? I know. Times are tough, dude. On the 16th of August, they write, I love you. I mean, straight to the point. Why beat around the bush, honestly? And then they replied again, I still love you. Over six months later, they're like, I still love you. I'm still here. You're lonely. Okay, this isn't meant to be a roast. I was just reading through my DMs. Who takes the time out of their day to just message me and says, you're lonely? Okay, cool. Yeah, maybe I am, but maybe I'm not. You'll never know. I mean, it's blatantly obvious what one I am, but that's fine. See, this is what I mean. How does it feel live? How does it... How does it... 
Speaking of, how does it feel living in Mully and Lannan's shadow? Well, they don't let me forget it, do they? I just want to be the biggest and the best. So if you're watching this and you're not subscribed, please consider doing so. I get asked this every single day. Like, I swear to God, every single day, whether it's in the DMs, on my Twitch streams, literally everyone wants to know if I'm making an OnlyFans. I've said it on a couple Instagram stories. No, I'm never making an OnlyFans. I have so much respect for all those women out there who do OnlyFans. Good on you. Get that bread. Make the bag. Is that get the bag. Yeah. Uh, but for me personally, it's not a direction I would like to go with content and uh, I'm just gonna stick to YouTube. So please subscribe. I could be making bank on OnlyFans right now, but I'm here with you guys. All right. So hit that subscribe button. Do you agree with me? Cheese is just edible milk. I don't, I don't think so. I don't think, I don't, they definitely taste different. Like way, way, way different. Why don't you have a boyfriend? I don't know. All right. Listen, man, I ask myself the same question every single damn day. Okay. So almost 18 months ago, they start off with a strong plus not just just one they're not asking a lot they just want one and then they hit me with the six times of show you and Ugh, yikes, dude. You come here often? Bites bottom lip sexually. Ugh, delete, the block. Ah. Oh, good question. How do you feel about your wiki feet page? Listen, it says I've got beautiful feet. I'm rated 4.6. I'm pretty happy with that, considering I think I have the ugliest feet ever. I feel good about it. I'm confident. Somebody DM me and goes, the queen died. What? Did somebody tell Lennon? Did somebody break the news? He is going to be so upset. This is a lot, okay? This is a lot. Marry me now, please. Imagine if I just married one of these people, you know? Like, I'm just like, yeah, sure. What do they do that? I'm like, okay, where are you? I'll fly to you right now. They're just like, oh, I, 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 I take it back. I take it back. It's like, you said it. There is just something about you that makes me want to wake up next to you every day. Yeah, you say that, dude. You say that, but you do it for a while. And trust me, I look terrible in the morning, okay? There is a reason I don't have a boyfriend. Hi, Tanner. I know this was over a year ago, but I still wanted to do it. Your brother, Laserbeam, asked people to send next to you. So I'm sorry for this, but I really want to do it. Just don't. I know that Lennon said that literally years ago now. He said it as a joke when he was much, much smaller. I think he had a million subs when he was like, ha ha ha, send pics of Tanner. Now he has almost 20 million. We did not understand the reach that Laser Beam would have one day. And those videos are still out there. So it's very difficult when kids like, I thought Laser Beam said to do it. And I'm just like, oh God, this was, this was a long time ago. Okay. I will block you and delete you. Don't. You can send funny messages when it comes to the actual pics. I can't get around it, dude. It's just nasty. I even checked my Discord DMs and uh, yeah, somebody just sent me the entire raid ad read, which listen, I, I know all too well. Shout out to raid. We love raid. So are we going to talk about click or just ignore the fact that once you joined, they stopped uploading videos? How many times do I have to say it? I am the reason that the group ended. Okay. There. I said it. They just hated making content with me that much. They were like, yeah, Tanner's joined. I'm just gonna, just gonna call it a day and just wipe my hands clean, okay? Do you want some sand? I have sand for you. Sand. Okay, can I just say, I wouldn't usually put this in here, but this man comes into every single stream I do and asks me if I want sand. And I just gotta commend the commitment and the dedication, okay? It's just beautiful. Yes, I want sand. Oh my God, the real Chris Hemsworth DM'd me on Twitter. It's real, 100%. I know that there isn't a check mark next to his name, but I can guarantee it's Chris Hemsworth, because he said, look, he says, hi, it's Chris Hemsworth, and my plane got stuck in Iceland, and I need money to get home. Can you give me money for private jet? If you don't believe me, I will get Robert Downey Jr. And then, guess who jumps on the phone? Robert Downey Jr. The real one, dude. Oh my god, this is actually happening. I can't believe it. I literally can't believe it. It's insane. Should I reply? Do I just say, yeah, like, just, just tell me how much you need. I got you. Want to go out? Nope. I'll give you my club penguin password if you respond. I wish I'd seen this earlier, okay? I wish I did. Please, it's a good deal. Please, just a reply, please, for my club penguin password. Offer is still up. Just have to say hi or something. This man's is giving me a gold mine. A club penguin password? Do you know how expensive they are? I wonder what he's got in the game. I wish I responded, honestly. Hey, so club penguin closed, but if you reply, you could get my Roblox password. You should get your out more on your posts. You'd get more followers. I'm an entrepreneuring genius, I know. If I got my out more, I'm sure it would get me more followers. But are they the kind of followers that I want? I don't think so. Hey, I'll move to Australia and be your boyfriend, okay? Thank you guys for so many nice offers. I really appreciate it, honestly. Somebody literally DM'd me and says, who are you? You're on my Twitter account. What do you mean, who am I? I don't know who I am either. How did I get here? I have imposter syndrome, okay? Send those n***s. I've never heard somebody refer to n***s as n***s. Well, there is a little bit of an insight into what goes on in my DMs. Nothing interesting. 
I also am already regretting making this video because I know that it's just going to make my DMs go nuts. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please follow me on Instagram at Tanner Ecott. Follow me on Twitter at Tanner. Follow me on TikTok at Tanner. Yeah, I hope you all have a lovely day. Subscribe.